And what's it been like since Scott Coker took over and your relationship with him? Well, it's brilliant, you know. Um, first off, I get the title shot, you know, a massive opportunity. And, and away from that, just being ringside for, for the card, uh, Stefan Bonner against Tito Ortiz and see, seeing how it's changed it from the promotion that I first fought on. Uh, when when uh, Bjorn was in charge, it, it's just a, a completely different uh, animal. It's great. And, uh, what are your thoughts on your opponent this title fight, Douglas Lima? He's a tough guy. He's a big, big, strong Brazilian guy. Um, he's got some good striking and a black belt in jiu-jitsu. That is basically Douglas Lima. Have you been impressed by striking and some of the finishes he's been putting together? He has put on some good good finishes um, against uh, not so good opponents. And if you put me in with the same guys, the same level of guys, I'll finish him probably quicker and, and in just as a spectacular fashion. You're a big worldwide name in MMA, let alone the, the UK's top welterweight. Do you feel um, a title and a big promotion like Bellator is the one thing missing from your resume? I've had a good career, so... Um, I'm happy, you know, uh, I owe a lot to the sport, but obviously I, I'm, in, I'm in this to be the champion, no matter where, where I'm at, whatever promotion I sign with, my ultimate goal is to be the champion, so uh, obviously uh, it's not the icing on the cake, it's just me doing what, what I set out to do with any promotion, so I will be the champion, and uh, yeah, that's it. And how do you think this fight's going to play out? It will be an entertaining fight, he'll, he'll come to bring it. Um, the fight will be over in three rounds. Um, he, will, he will have uh, the biggest test of his career, which he will ultimately lose. And I can see a stoppage, either standing on the feet um, or ground and pound. OK, a few Bellator fights coming up. We'd like to get your predictions on some of the outcomes. Patricio Pitbull versus Daniel Strauss for the Bellator featherweight championship. Strauss, he's very good. Uh, any particular way? Uh, he, he's a versatile fighter. He can win in numerous ways. Submission, ground and pound, knockout on the feet. He's a good fighter, Daniel Strauss. And Alex Shemenko versus Melvin Manhoff, Bellator 133. Ah, man. It's an awkward one because Melvin, Melvin's my boy, but he, he's, uh, he's had an uh, unlucky run at present. Um, it just depends. It's a 50-50 fight, this one. They're both uh, heavy hitters. Um, Shemenko's slightly more versatile. Uh, but they both can throw down, so I, I can't really call that fight. I don't know.